Hello everyone. Well, our venue today is a true football monument. I'm talking, of course, about the San Siro. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And we're focusing on live action from Italy's top division, Serie A. What do you anticipate seeing, Stuart? Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. This is the Milan starting 11. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Davide Calabria plays with Theo Hernandez in the wide defensive areas. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And introducing the visitors lineup today. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. And now they get the ball rolling. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. On the ball, Rafael Leao. Ben Asser. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. Options in the centre. Ibrahimovic. High quality defending. Retza. Verde. Well, they're eyeing that final pass, you just feel. It might be on for them. Committed challenge. Zlatan Ibrahimovic Rafael Leao Ben Asser well, They're keeping their opponents moving and guessing And Milan moving the ball with purpose Can they keep it out? Well, we like to call things as we see them, Stuart, and I must say, he's got that one horribly wrong. Well, it's a poor decision in the end. It's way off target. Manai. Verde. possibilities here and the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save and over it comes and thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Oh, it's 
a goal! And certainly a deflection off the defender into the back of the net. Well, let's take another look. And there's the deflection. And from that moment on, the keeper had no chance, did he? So back on the way, and here's the question. Can Milan articulate the right reply? Brahim. Vanessa. Rafael Leao. Teo Hernandez. On to Ibrahimovic. Options in the middle. Sandro Tonali. Well read to win possession back. Well, there it is. The away side haven't had as much of the ball, but their counter-attacking has been really good, particularly in the wide areas. It's been an excellent performance from them so far. Moving the ball nicely, looking for that final pass. I just couldn't play that decisive ball. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Brahim Diaz now. Rafael Leao. Could play it in. No high quality defending. Well, as we approach half-time, Milan know full well they've got a bit of work ahead of them. Stuart, what have you made of their performance in the first half? Well, I've been a little disappointed with their attacking play. It's all been a bit too slow. If they can pass it into their front areas with more quality, switch play quicker, and be more positive in 1v1 situations, I think they'll get back into this. Crossing into the middle. Well, nothing for the players in the middle to work with. And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Just not looking confident in possession. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Well, we don't utter these words very often, but Zlatan Ibrahimovic has been poor in this match. Well, Derek, he's usually so clever around the edge of the box, but today he just hasn't shown that. As the touch map shows us, he hasn't had enough touches in those key areas. And now they get the ball rolling. Well, we like to call things as we see them, Stuart, and I must say he's got that one horribly wrong. Well, it's a poor decision in the end. It's way off top. And possibilities here. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. And over it comes. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Oh, it's a goal! And certainly a deflection off the defender. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Giulio Maggiore. Emmanuel Jassi. Maggiore. Not a clear foul, but the referee letting the play flow. Manai. It's neat passing, confidence on the ball. 
And space for the cross. Well, they haven't overcome all their difficulties. Intercepting it intelligently. Ben Asser. It is a decent looking attack here. Sandro Tonali. Ibrahimovic. On to Ibrahimovic. Ibrahimovic. Oh, maybe the equaliser. Capable of so much better from that position. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. Well, as the stats confirm, Milan have controlled the ball. But they aren't doing enough with it. They need to pass it quicker, play forward earlier and show more energy. Otherwise, they won't get back into this one. Ibrahimovic. Rebic. And diving to thwart him. Well, just listen to the crowd. They know this is a big chance to equalise. Substitution time it is. And he's fired over the corner. Oh, he's gone for goal. Smuggled away. Sandro Tonali. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Rafael Leao. The Rossoneri pushing forward with options available. A good and fair challenge. Well, that's a pass of high quality. I think the referee was spot on there. A free kick in the end after he had attempted to play advantage. Well, a little lucky to get away without a card. Might be his last warning, though. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Verde. Manai. And he read it well defensively. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Looks as though they might make real progress on the counter-attack. Not so. Prahim. Giroud! Oh, a good diving save. Time really is of the essence. What can they do from this situation? Substitution time it is here. Over it comes. Vanessa. Tomori. Excitement and the match is level.
Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging someone to get on the end of it, and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. Back underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. And taking it away. Charles de Quetelare. On the attack, is there to be late excitement? Giro! Well, the keeper had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. Well, this corner could be pivotal. It might represent their last chance to get in front in the dying moments. Elects to go short. Well shown inside. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Trying to pick out a teammate. Giroud. Defensive excellence there. And mopping up defensively. Happy to take on the shot. Well, able to close down the shot. And there's the whistle. They can't be separated after 90 minutes. And now they get the ball rolling. Well, we like to call things as we see them, Stuart, and I must say he's got that one horribly wrong. Well, it's a poor decision in the end. It's way off. Top. And possibilities here. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. And over it comes. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Oh, it's a goal! And certainly a deflection off the defender. Well, just listen to the crowd. They know this is a big chance to equalise. Prahim. Oh, a good diving save. Time really is of the essence. What can... Tomori. What late excitement, and the match is level. On the attack, is there to be late excitement? Shiro! Well, the keeper had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there.